Hey guys, so the artwork I chose to talk about in this assignment is a painting that was painted by Picasso in 1937. It is called The Portrait of Dora Maar. Um, Dora Maar came into Picasso's life in 1936. She was a professional photographer, which makes me wonder if um, she ev ever took any photos of Picasso since he did take the time to paint this portrait of her. This is an oil painting. It is roughly four by three. Um, the painting is shown in a combined frontal and profile view, which is what I noticed initially and is what drew me to the photo because it kind of just made me stop and stare at the portrait before I went and did some further research about it. So I was trying to figure out um, what she looked like and what the focal point of her face was supposed to be. So I found it very interesting and once I found that he did that on purpose, it was more interesting to me, which is why I chose it for this assignment. Um, it's obviously very colorful. You do notice the different details such as her hat, her long nails, her outfit, um, and things like that. There are, um, there is some dimension. You can tell she's sitting closer up in a room with the wall further behind her. You can see some dimension in the ceiling. In my opinion, there isn't much texture. Um, so it just seems like just a bunch of lines and very straight and strict and, you know, precise and to the point. <laughs> so um, she is sitting in a chair. She looks to be somewhat comfortable. It makes me wonder how close her and Picasso were. Um, also, I should mention that if you Google the portrait of Dora Maar, you will notice that there are several, several different variations to this painting. I read an article somewhere that said that he created this painting over several, dif over several different occasions, and they are all somewhat different. Some of them, a lot of them have her hand propped against her face, and this one it doesn't. But, um, but for the most part, they're all really colorful and they all, um, have the same side profile and frontal profile view, which is, I think, the main identifier of this painting. So, um, yeah, it makes me wonder how close her and Picasso were, and it makes me want to go do some further research about that, because he created this several different times, so... Um, I'm sure there's some research about that, and I just need to go dive a little deeper. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video.